Now we're gonna head out to the black cod grounds and try and see if we can catch a couple of these black cod way down deep. Black cod don't have great eyesight because you're fishing so deep and it's so dark down there. So it's more of a scent fishery. So we have a couple pieces of pollock on circle hooks right to the bottom because you have so much line out. The bites are very, very finicky and, and, and subtle. This is going downtown. Oh, this is this is Chatham Straits. This is the, you know, some people say the best black cod fishery on the planet. Wow. This whole this whole thing it drops down 16, 1800. The deepest I've seen up here is about 2200 feet. Um, it's just loaded with black cod. And you got us in about nice 1700 feet right now. Yeah, I'm going easy on you. <laughs> warm gonna, up, don't worry, warm we're going deep. Tone. We're going deep. <laughs> this much line out, you're just looking for little line bumps. It's like Willie was talking about last night in the swordfish, going deep. You're just, you're just looking for little taps and just like the herring, just let them, let them hook themselves up. You'll get hopefully two on there. So you're not cranking all the two for one special, hey? Yeah. Oh, he's taking lines to halibut. I might have tripled up here at Willie. Whoa. I hope so. We had a line burner over here. I still got a ways to go. A ways. It almost felt like when I came up a couple hundred feet that something else latched on. Very well could have. Because it just kind of went bump, There's bump. 200 feet of biomass on the bottom. I mean, the solid 200 feet is something running down there. Hold on here. Come on, buddy. Oh, there it is. Shark Raker! Shark Raker! <laughs> <laughs> you, you got a balloon up there. <laughs> Look something. at that thing. That is unbelievable. That is humongous. Bro. Oh, it's a giant! Oh! 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 That wow! That, that, my friend, <laughs> is a shark raker. Oh, my. Oh, that's for real. <laughs> that's a long raker. That's a long, that's a long raker. raker. <laughs> Oh my wow. God, that's awesome. That is awesome. I actually thought I had a nice black cod and maybe even had two black cod on there. And when all of a sudden the, the crew on board yelled, it's a short raker. My initial thought was we gotta release this fish back into the water. But you know, bringing this fish up from that deep, I mean, by the time he got to the surface, he was gonna perish. It's unfortunate that we weren't able to release the fish. There has been documentation of you know, short rakers up to 60 pounds caught, and they estimate those fish to be about 65 years old. So this fish here weighed 30 pounds. It was quite the experience uh, to see that fish up close and personal and just, uh, you know, just the beautiful colors and the size of this fish was incredible. I think I've kind of developed a love-hate relationship with black cod fishing. You know, I love the fact that it's very satisfying, but I'll tell you, my wrist and my forearm and shoulder are gonna be sore tomorrow. That's a lot of reeling. We probably reeled over 8,000 feet of line today. Having a chance to come up to Willers Cove Lodge and experiencing the fishing and to be able to experience catching that short raker, you know, essentially a fish of a lifetime. You know, it's something that I'll remember forever. The first couple of days here at Whalers Cove Lodge have been amazing. Really looking forward to see what's gonna happen here the next couple of days at the lodge because the first two days were absolutely incredible.